I'm Anna Tonicliff. We're in Miami competing at the Rolex uh, Miami OCR Regatta. And how's it going so far? So far it's going well. Um, it's, uh, today was a bit of a tough day. We had very light conditions. But uh, the racing's been good and competitive, and uh, it, the points are close between me and Paige. And why is this event, the OCR, important to you in an overall Olympic campaign? This event's important to me because it's a team qualifier, and so we have to finish top three Americans to make the U.S. sailing team. And also, um, it's the second leg of the ISAF Sailing World Cup, and uh, I'm hopefully going to try and win that again, win that this year. And your specific goal this week? This week, uh, is to finish top three overall and to make the U.S. sailing team. And who are you most concerned with in your fleet? Uh, my tightest competition right now is Paige, really. Um, and, you know, it's kind of what I expected. Um, but we've, we've been training together before this event and uh, had some really good sessions and both going well. So it um, should be a good battle all the way to the end. And lastly, how has winning a gold medal changed your focus for events like or your approach for events like this? I think winning the gold medal um, has changed me in that I can relax a little bit more, knowing that I can do it when pressure's on. Um, but, you know, at the same time, that was just an regatta, and, you know, I performed and peaked at the right time. And so coming here, me having a gold medal doesn't mean I get any less slack on the start line or any more room at the mark, you know, so I still have to sail hard and fight for it. Um, but it just puts my mind at ease a little bit that I don't get quite as nervous.